That's fun. Well, at least we got an armored guard to start. All right, let's crush this thing. That's cool. Nice. Yeah, I had no idea that they were still making uh, factions for Summon Wars. That's fun. Oh, I did get this. It's a neoprene mat for ashes for Red Rains. So I'm excited for that whenever we... uh, We'll probably do ashes next week because I'm in an ashes mood now. So... All righty. Five cards to start us out. Give me another face the past. We've got Kid Omega, Reinforced Suit, Inspired, Mjolnir, and Four Asgard. We're going to mulligan these four. I'm going to keep Kid Omega. I think Kid Omega is going to be pretty nice to take a hit. We got a Hammer Throw. Hammer Throw. Let's go. Build Support. And a Squared Off. Yikes. Uh, not great. Okay, so rules question. Squared off. Discard cards from the encounter deck until you discard a minion, period. Do I draw my two cards at that point? Um, or do I finish the card? I put the minion into play engaged with you. Play an ally from your hand, reducing its cost by three. I think the minion... I don't think I draw until after I play the... Uh, play it unfortunately i'm gonna grab mjolnir nice can't draw till it engages you right um but i'm wondering so it engages me arrow play an ally from your hand reducing its cost by three so it engages me do I draw the cards, then I play my ally? Or do I play my ally, then draw my cards? Basically, can I draw into an ally that I play? Put that minion into play engage with you to play an ally from your hand. I, you draw first. That's, that, seems, that seems exciting. We could do that. Actually, regardless, I'm doing that for Kid Omega. I, it, I'm overpaying for Kid Omega, Omega, but that's fine. That's 100% fine because I get plus two cards. So, yeah. Now, if it's one of the, the giant... Hmm. It'll be fine. Cool. Well, okay. Play an ally from your hand. Put it engaged with you. Play an ally from your hand. Yeah, that's a that's interesting. Alrighty. We're gonna flip up to Thor. You can draw first and decide to play a different ally. Sweet. Let's play squared off. Discard cards until we get an ally. Or a minion. It is Electro. Retaliate one villainous after Electro engages you or activate against you. Discard cards from the encounter deck until you discard a lightning or a wild resource. Oh no. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, there's the Bifrost. Yikes. Okay. Uh, I'm going to draw two cards. God of Thunder and a Reinforced Suit. And we're going to play Kid Omega from our hand, reducing its cost by three. Okay. When Kid Omega enters play, we're going to toss a Hammer Throw to deal a damage to each one of these. I'm going to go Reinforce Suit and Hammer Throw. Actually, you know what? I may not play that. I may not do that. Because I think I may want to just... We can play Hammer Throw to take out Electro. Hmm. That that's uh that's interesting. I think I I think I need to clean this up before I build. 
So I'm not going to spend the resource here. Um, but I am going to go Hammer Throw to play Mjolnir. Goes the plus one. I think I'm okay having this armored guard here. So I think I'm going to... I could, so I could hit the armored guard and have, or with Kid Omega to knock the tough, Thor could take out the armored guard. I don't think I need to, I think I'd rather thwart, so I don't necessarily need Mjolnir on the table right now. So let's go hammer throw on Electro. It's going to overkill two. Mjolnir comes back to my hand. He's gone. Kid Omega is going to thwart two, and then Thor will thwart one off a of defense network. Remove that crisis. All right. Stand up. This Yeah, this mod set's not great. Uh, we got a Mjolnir, Heimdall, Inspired, and Defender of the Nine Realms. All righty. We'll go Tooth right here. Claw's going to attack. We're going to block with Kid Omega. It's going to be one. Put Weapons Runner into play. Engage with you. That's going to draw us two cards. We've got Nick Fury and a Genius. And then we'll take two from here. Oh, and Kid Omega is uber gone. Our encounter card is a illegal arms factory. It's going to come in with four threats. And one of these nasty... Encounter cards there. All righty. Um, Defender of the Nine Realms. I'm gonna discard until we get a minion. Scorpion. After Scorpion attacks and damages the character, stun that character. If it's already stunned, deal two damage to it. It's gonna draw us one, two, and remove threat from here. Got Genius, Inspired, and Heimdall to play Nick Fury. It's going to draw us three cards. Beta Ray Bill, Call for Backup, and the Treskellion. Defender will play Mjolnir. Scorpion is toughness. So that's good. Um, this mod set is tough. But it's the fact that you don't even get this inner, inner six. They all have three boost. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to knock the tough with Nick. Thor will hit him for three. We're going to toss the hand for Asgard. Oh, we're in trouble. All right, it'll be fine. We'll stand up. We'll draw five cards now. Lightning Strike. That's nice. Lady Sif. Defender. Quinn Carrier. And Squared Off. All right, so we got a Squared Off Lady Sif. So that's nice. So. Got two. Claw's going to attack us for one plus two boost icons. I'm tempted to take this. Um, mainly because I can use Nick to block Scorpion, and I don't get stunned then. And I have 12 health. I'm going to take effectively three plus two boost cards. I think I am okay with that. I think I would rather do that than be stunned and try and figure out my life after a stun. I do have a ready with Lady Sif. I'm going to take it. So it's going to be one uh, plus five is six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, down to four. And then we're going to block Scorpion with Nick. Okay. Encounter card is Claw's Vengeance. Claw attacks you. The attack deals damage. Place one threat on the main scheme. This will probably be game. We're going to defend this. I'm going to go one. 
put weapon runner into gauge. So it's four total. We take two damage, one, two. But we do get to draw two cards, which is X and God of Thunder. And it did deal damage, so we're going to go up to three. All righty. Cool. Cool. Yikes. <laughs> Brutal. Uh, okay. We do have a lightning strike. Okay, if we go Lady Sif, God of Thunder. We don't have enough to play Quinn Carrier, but we could go squared off and potentially draw into. And if we can deal three damage, we clear all of this. Way off topic, but I hope they add Squirrel Girl to the game. Yeah, Squirrel Girl would be awesome. Yeah, Squirrel Girl would be great. Let's play squared off. Oh, under fire does not go there. Let's play squared off. We're going to discard cards until we get a armored guard. We'll draw one, two. Then we're going to play Professor X from our hand. and conf Oh, I didn't do an extra card here. It's Dr. Ock. Okay. Little revisionist, but that's fine. All right, we got a uh, confused there. Okay. We did draw the cards. X is now in play. Cool. We go lightning. Squirrel go would be sick. Could be all about uh, putting purpose counters on cards as squirrels and gaining effects based on how many squirrels. That'd be fun. <laughs> That'd be really fun. Um, okay, we're going to... We're going to go Quinn Carrier and Defender of the Nine Realms to play God of Thunder. We're going to use Lightning Strike to play Lightning Strike. We're going to use God of Thunder, Hammer Throw, and Lady Sif to deal three damage. We do have Aerial, so we're ignoring Tough. So it's going to be one, two, three. It's going to wipe everything here. And three damage on Doc Ock. Imagine a world where we're getting all 15 signature cards or different squirrel. <laughs> Game day and forgot your dice. If we thwart three here that goes down to two, we will lose on Doc Ock. Or we'll 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 scheme out on Doc Ock. Um But we're at two health. We have to flip down, right? I mean, there is no... If we stay up, we could defend Dr. Octopus. We're, we're taking three encounter cards, which is tough. Um, scientists apparently just found a 35,000-year-old saber-toothed tiger kitten. Aww. Um... We could accept... No, because then we'll die. Uh, let's go ahead and thwart here. Take this down to two. I think we'll defend Doc Ock and hopefully not die. We, I mean, we could... We could, hmm, we could flip down. We're, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna risk it. Let's stand up. We've got squared off, energy, and counter card. 
So now they can perform analysis on pause first. Oh, that's cool. Huh. That's cool. I wonder if it'd be the player version of Ultron taking the top card of the villain deck. Oh, that'd be fun. Saber Tooth, not so much. Finally catching a live. Hey, Luther, how's it going? How's life? We are in what we would consider a precarious situation. One threat on each scheme. That's brutal. We got Bifrost, Reinforced Suit. Oh, that's a tough hand. Ah, alrighty. Here we go. Two, four. Claw's going to attack. We'll block. I'm going to play one there. And one here. So, Professor X actually survives. How funny is that? Uh, we will block Dr. Octopus. And we'll place one threat on each scheme. And we've got three cards. First one is Hobgoblin, Patrol Villainous. We're going to draw a call for backup. Okay, we got Lightning Strike. At least we got a lot of Lightnings. Dark Designs. Place a Pursuit Counter. Lose the Confuse. I play Thor due to Come Get Me, Bub. What's new? Oh, uh... I've, I've uh, squared off. Squared off is a lot of fun. So discard cards from the encounter deck until you discard a minion. Put that minion into play. Engage with you. Which we will probably do. I assume there's another minion in there. We did get the Sonic Converter. X goes away. Going to get the hidden achievement for defeating all six of them. Yes. yes. Amazing. Okay, we're gonna we're going to hopefully draw into a minion with squared off. Okay, we got Craven the Hunter. After Craven the Hunter attacks and damages a character you control, we're going to draw into a band together and a band together. So we whiffed on the squared off, and band togethers are dead cards in our hand. So that's fun. Um, we use Call for Backup to play Lightning Strike. Um, we'll spend two, four, five, six to clear these guys. And go one, two, three, four, five, six. We're going to flip down to Alter Ego. We're going to toss the band together. Whew. Okay. Going to stand up. We got Hammer Throw, Treskelion, Quinn Carrier, Hammer Throw, Genius, Inspired. We're going to lose the main. Discard cards until we get a minion. Dang it, there was a minion. I was hoping that that last card was not a minion. Okay, fine. We got a minion. Claw is going to scheme for two plus a booze card. So my boss is bald, and in the morning he wheels out of his office with his desk chair to fill a waste high employee board. I told him yesterday he needs to be perfect. That'd be sick. <laughs> uh, so we're going to scheme for two, three. We got two encounter cards. First one is Defense Network. Ooh, that's going to be tough. That's going to be real, real tough right there. And we got Hobgoblin. All righty. Okay. That's going to be game. I don't I don't see a way out of this. I don't I don't I don't see it. I don't see a I don't see a path. Thor when he has to thwart. No! Right? All right, let's swap out Sinister Assault. Or, I mean, like, we could probably... Let's try it one more time. Let's try it one more time. I don't feel like we got the engine up. Told you that... Oh, yeah, 100%. <laughs> let's 
go back up to 18. Go up to 14. The hazard icon was brutal. Yeah. Yeah. I guess Immortal Claw. I never I never put the extra threat on Immortal Claw. So let's do that. Claw is 28 health. All right. Bend the module and grab Bomb Scare. <laughs> I believe in us. I'm going to try it one more time. We didn't get the squared off turn one, which was a big boost. We need a minion. I'm hoping that it is not a big one. Not a Sinister Assault minion, please. Okay, it is. Doc Ock, inside two. Well, threat's already an issue. Uh <laughs> All right. So we got two, four, five. Face the past. Let's go. Mjolnir, we can toss. Hammer throw, we will probably keep. Lightning strike and reinforce suit. We're going to toss those. The hammer throw can take care of Doc Ock. We've got build support. Genius. Squared off. All right. We're going to grab Mjolnir with Worthy. Flip up to Thor. Let's play face the past. Wait, uh, before before we do that, because we get a ready. I forgot that we get a ready. So let's think about our lives. Um, let's do let's do a build support. I don't know. I don't think build support should be in this deck to play Mjolnir. We're gonna hit Doc Ock for three. Then we're going to play Face the Past. We got Loki. We are going to ready, draw five cards. One, two, three, four, five. Let's go. What are you trying with Thor? This is uh, mainly squared off and Face the Past. Uh, we'll go ahead and punch Doc Ock. Take Doc Ock out. We'll go Genius for a God of Thunder. We've got God of Thunder, Reinforced Suit, Squared off to play X. No. I'm trying to figure, I, I don't want to play another, I don't want to play squared off. But if I do play squared off, it puts X into play. We have another minion and we have a hammer throw. And we can put Mjolnir back on the table. I I think I think this is not I don't think that's worth it. Remove oh yes, thank you. We can go Lady Sif. It's going to be X. We're we're going to play X. We could stun Loki. Uh we have we have health now. So I think what we're going to do, we're going to hang on to squared off. I think we may hang on to Lady Sif. Reinforce suit, hammer throw, and God of Thunder. We'll play Professor X. We'll confuse Claw. 
X will go ahead and thwart three off the defense network. Put together a protection Star Lord that's all about pulling out tre treacheries and minions to pseudo control the struggles of the encounter card drawing. Utilize the Spider Man Noir to hold. Oh, that's cool. That's fun. I love how many cool builds there are in this game. Honestly, I may hang on to this hand right here because a squared off. Yeah, we're just going to draw one card. It's Asgard. Sweet. Let's stand up. We got two threat here. It's going to go to four. Claw is going to attack. We're going to block with X. We one. Weapons runner. We get to draw some cards and dark designs. Again, X survives. X is very resilient these days. I'm going to draw into Defender of the Nine Realms and Defender of the Nine Realms. We're going to take three here. One, two, three. Our encounter card is a Exhaustion Surge, Exhaust Our Identity into an Evil Alliance. So I need to read how this looks. If your Nemesis minion is in play, it activates against you. Okay, so we'll take two damage. That actually was not too bad. Professor X has been working out. He saw Magneto made into a hero and wants the same treatment. 100%. Okay, X is going to go there. We could go Defender. No, we're going to go Squared Off. Discard cards from the encounter deck until you discard a minion. Let's go. Gosh, I'm so happy it did not hit like a... Something worse. We're going to draw two cards. We got God of Thunder and a Band Together. We're going to play a card from our hand, reducing its cost by three. It's going to be Miss Lady Sif, which will ready Thor. Okay. If we can hang on to God of Thunder, that'd be nice. Um... Or right, hang on to Defender, that'd be nice. Um, I think we're going to try and hammer throw... I think we're going to try and hammer throw Loki. I am enjoying Max. Inside 2 is brutal. Inside 2 is not great. Um, we don't have to play God of Thunder. We could do this. I think I think maybe a hammer throw into Loki. Because if we don't lose Loki, or if Loki leaves play, we can flip down. So let's try this. Let's go hammer throw into Loki. Mjolnir is going to come back to our hand. Four damage. It is not a treachery, so Loki leaves play. We got four overkill here. One, two, three, four. Um, okay, that feels good. Lady Sif will thwart two here. We get damage there. We'll use... We're going to have used Asgard instead of God of Thunder for the hammer throw. Defender of the Nine Realms and Mjolnir will play God of Thunder. We're going to hit Weapons Runner, take him out. We're going to flip down to Odin's son. Let's stand up. We got Clarity of Purpose, Beast, squared off. There we go. Call for backup. And band together. Two, four, five. We're going to go up to four here. We're confused. Zero. Encounter card is a sonic boom. Spend uh, one of each resource or exhaust each character you control. Uh, I'll exhaust. Alrighty, we'll grab Mjolnir. Ah! We're about to draw this. 
Grab Mjolnir using Worthy. We're going to flip up to Thor. We have a squared off. So let's play... Let's play squared off. We're going to discard cards until we get a Electro. Retaliate one Villainous. After he engages or activates, discard cards from the top of your deck until you discard a Lightning Resource. There it goes the Bifrost. And then I'm going to draw two cards, which is a Strength and a Treskelion. And I get to play a card from my hand, reducing its cost by three, or an ally, reducing its cost by three, which will be God of Thunder to play Beast. And then we'll grab a Band Together when Beast enters play. All righty. We got God of Thunder to play Mjolnir. I don't... I, I have too many resources. No! That's sad. Gotta run, but wish you brave luck. What? Thank you. See ya! Speaking of Star-Lord, I made a Gunpo deck that uses Leader of the Guardians for extra damage. That's cool. Uh, strength. We'll play Call for Backup. Band together, we'll play Treskelion. Band together, we'll play Clarity of Purpose. Beast will thwart two. Thor, I got too many new re <laughs> too many resources. That's new, right? <laughs> nice. Ooh, alrighty. We are at nine. We have some blockers. Uh, giant. Best aspect for Magneto, I think, is going to be leadership. X-Men, he's an X-Men. Leadership was absurdly strong. All righty. Let's draw one. Squared off. Nick Fury, love that combo. Cyclops is also pretty cool. And a hammer throw. Nice. I'm going to go up to four. Claw is going to attack. We're going to block with Lady Sif. Oh, seven. Brutal. We got uh, two from here. One, two, and we're going to discard until we get a lightning or a wild. Oh, no. Okay, there goes energy. Encounter card is Sonic Converter. Attach the claw after he attacks and damages the character. Stun that character. Cool. All righty. Let's play squared off. Discard cards until you get a minion. Or scorpion. After scorpion attacks and damages the character, uh, bad things happen. We get to draw one, two. And we are going to play a ally from our hand. We're going to use... God of Thunder to play Nick, which will draw us into Lightning Strike, Quinn Carrier, and Kid Omega. Nice. I think we're going to... Okay, if I can get a lightning strike off. Go band together, hammer throw, clarity of purpose, and god of thunder. That clears everything. So that's nice. If I put Kid Omega into play, we're good. That's a brutal encounter set. I don't think Thor is that good in killing. We're... we're we're trying it. We're stress testing it. Uh, let's okay. Okay, so Cyclops and Quinn Carrier are going to play Kid Omega. We are not going to choose Activate his Response. We are going to use Inspire to play Lightning Strike. We're going to spend one, two, three, four, five, six to deal six damage to everything on the table. And Claw. 
One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Kid Omega and Thor will take out Copper backup. Which I think we'll I think we'll get. Heimdall is not bad. Lady Sif. Lady Sif isn't bad here either. We can just clean up some stuff. Um, uh, we're going to grab Professor X. We're going to lose. No, I don't think we're going to grab Professor X. We can go Heimdall. We can go Beta Ray Bill, which I think is our last card in the deck. Or one of the last cards in the deck. Let's go Heimdall. After he enters play, we're going to look at the top three. Okay, so we got an encounter card, which will be armor guard, and then we can go dark designs as one of our encounter or one of our boost cards. But we are going to deck out, so we'll at least get the card draw here, which will be nice. Okay. We got Heimdall and Nick. We'll take out the Immortal Claw. Take them down ten, down to eight. And then Beast will thwart this down to two. Spicy Leadership Wednesday. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Alrighty. Let's stand up. The unfortunate thing is that these allies are going to be in my discard pile now. But... We got Beta Ray Bill inspired encounter card. All right. Okay. I like We're uh we're 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 doing some stuff. We're doing some stuff. I do like the band together lightning strike. I think that's a lot of fun. I think I take out um build support. I don't think build support needs to be in the deck. I guess it could grab Asgard if you wanted it to, but I don't think build support needs to be in the deck. I think we're running at 42, so we could just cut it. Um, inspired Energy and a Cyclops. I'm going to go up to three. Claw is going to attack. I'm going to block with Nick. It's going to be... Uh, Nick does die. And we get one here. My girlfriend and I put together a duos list. Heroes that either are close friends or partners. And we plan on having those be the games we... Oh, that's fun. That's fun. Are you leaning into, like, the uh, team-up cards? We got Armored Guard, which has Guard and Toughness. We get to draw two cards. Thor's Helmet and Squared Off. And then we got Sinister Strike. We're going to place one, and then he's going to attack. Um, We'll toss Kid Omega in front of that one. There's going to be a lot. We got Weapons Runner engaged and one counter here. All righty. Squared off. Ooh, I don't know if, we're gonna, if we have a minion. We do. Let's go. Armor Guard. We get to draw one, two. And we're going to go energy to play Beta Ray Bill. There we go. It'd be a real long list if Daredevil was added to the game. Pretty sure at some point he's been romantically involved with most characters in the comments. That's funny. <laughs> that's that's. We got God of Thunder, God of Thunder, build support. We'll play Asgard. Beta Ray Bill will take out the weapons runner. Remove right here uh, we're gonna throw a Thor's helmet on the table to give us five hit points one two three four five we got beast and Thor will take out one of these armored guards um Heimdall will knock the tough here. 
We're going to need to do it eventually. All right, let's stand up. Got band together. Lightning strike. That's what we're talking about. Lady Sif. The Bifrost. And squared off. Beautiful. Claw's going to attack. We're going to block with beast. It's going to be one. All right, it's going to be a lot. It's enough to take beast out. We get an acceleration icon. And we're resetting the deck. Armor Guard is going to hit us for one. Take us down to ten. We've got an encounter card. We are using them and removing signature allies that match the characters, but aren't limiting ourselves to just ones with those cards. Nice. Black Panther and Storm were married. I don't. That's cool. I don't think I knew that. That's fun. All right. Counter card is a weapon runner. We'll, we'll draw two. Got a strength and a hammer throw, and that's going to surge into a Doc Ock, which is going to incite two. All righty, let's go ahead and throw three here. We're going to play squared off. We'll discard until we get scorpion. So it comes with tough. We get to draw two cards. We got a genius and a reinforced suit. And we're going to use... Uh, God of Thunder to play Lady Sif, which we'll ready Thor. Let's do... Let's play... He's at 8 health. trying to figure out if I th okay i think i think the best i think the best thing to do here is to not go six with our lightning strike we're going to spend a god of thunder for a lightning strike we're going to play band together to deal three to everything that's going to clear all of these and do three damage here ignoring the tough status card okay we will Use Lady Sif to knock the tough here. And then Beta Ray Bill will take out Scorpion and two threat here. I think that's probably the most effective way to do that. We could push. Um, what happens when Claw gets pushed? Nothing really. Okay. We have Lady Sif, Heimdall, Beta Ray Bill. These are our Asgard characters, so Bifrost doesn't help us too, too much. Um, we could play Reinforced Suit on Beta Ray Bill. Do we have another Reinforced Suit coming? We do. So I think we're going to go Genius and Reinforced Suit to Hammer Throw to push Claw. It's going to come in with Tough. Oh, I don't think we actually need to do that because he he also took three damage, but here we are. Okay. Comes in with 22 health. Yeah, pushing claw is not the not the worst. Um I don't care about the Sonic Converter, really. Um, for 10 health, let's go Clarity of Purpose to play Mjolnir. Put that back onto the table. We'll go Genius to play Bifrost. Just have it. 
Um, Thor will run a lot into the top. And let's stand up. We got Heimdall as a blocker if we need him. I also really like his three attack stats. So let's see what our hand looks like. Got a hammer throw. That's good. Quinn carriers. Hammer. Two hammer throws. And a squared off. Okay, we got... We're going to four here. Um... Block with Lady Sif. Gonna be three, six. Uh, ooh, we get a, we get our, we get Loki. Lady Sif is uber dead, by the way, and Loki is gonna come in and your Nemesis minion is in play. It activates. Other ways, flip this card. After you flip this card, find your Nemesis and reveal it. Search the set aside area for your Nemesis side scheme. So we're gonna get all of that too. Hey, Blazing. How are you doing? I'm doing pretty good. We're, uh, we're having some fun with Blue Thor. So we're going to draw Professor X and Defender. And we also going to get Family Feud. Place one additional Threat of Reach Asgard in play. We got one, two, three, four, uh, a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six seven eight nine so this is going to come in with uh 11 threats aka we're not touching it then these get shuffled in okay loki's gonna hit us for two we'll take it and we got uh evil alliance there you go each nemesis and minion in play activates we got one too Alrighty. I think I played that wrong last time, but here we are. Claws at 22 health. Um, let's play squared off. Discard until we get a minion. It's Vulture. Quick strike. Villainous. Uh, we'll take it. So it's going to hit us for one plus three is four. One, two, three, four. That's brutal. Um, discard one random card from your hand. Four. There goes Professor X. Well, that's actually. Yeah, all that happens. And now we do not have an ally to play. So we just whiffed on the squared off. That's tough. Yikes. Oops. Oops. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, that's fun. I should have one more card, which is another defender. Oh, okay. We don't need we have too many defenders. Vulture is a jerk. Let's go with a Defender of the Nine Realms to play a Lightning Strike. Let's go one, two. Three, four. Loki's Interrupt. It is a Treachery, so he's going to stay. We got four and four. One, two, three, four. Beta Ray Bill is going to take Vulture out. Take this down to two. I think Loki is the only scenario for Mad Titan Shadow I haven't tried yet. Yeah, it's... I can't believe we discarded... This is, this is just Thor's nemesis, yes. All right, I'm going to flip down. I'm going to heal for four. One, two, three, four. We're going to add, go up to five. Claw will scheme out. Loki will scheme on the next one. So. 
I guess we'll have Heimdall hit Claw for one, two, three. Uh, I'm going to keep the def one defender in my hand. We'll stand up. Actually, let's see if I have any squared offs coming up. There's one, two, three. Yeah, so we'll keep a defender. Defender, band together, four Asgard, band together, inspire two, four, five, reinforce suit, you get an encounter card. I did Loki, Mad Titan, Shadow a few weeks back. Wasn't as punishing as I remember it being. Must have been the mod set. He's just annoying. I think that's really what it is. Okay. Got a two, four, six. We're going to go a lot. Claw's going to scheme out. So discard cards until we get a minion. Okay. We're going to add three here. And our two cards. We got Claw's Vengeance. Discard one card at random from your hand. One, two, three, four. Band together. That's fine. And Illegal Arms Factory coming in with four. He has 15 health. All right. Huh. Um. Trying to figure out if I want to heal. I don't think I do. I think we're going to have to have Beta Ray Bill, Chump Lock, or if I draw into something, we'll be good. Um, I think I'd rather... I think I need to thwart. So tough. Okay, let's flip up to Thor. We do have the Bifrost, though. That's That's important. That is really important, actually. Do have the Bifrost. So we will heal here. One, two, three, four. We're going to flip up. We got four Asgard, God of Thunder, God of Thunder, Clarity of Purpose to play Lady Sif. Which will ready Thor. Okay. Let's play Defender of the Nine Realms. We're going to discard until we get a minion. Armored Guard. That's fine. We're going to draw Build Support, Professor X. Curious what your thoughts about something. Do you think someone who doesn't play Marvel Champions solo or with anyone else, but with one person who has all the content? Do you think someone who doesn't play Marvel Champions solo or with anyone else, but with one person who has all the content wouldn't make sense for them to play or to own the stuff just to play with the other person's stuff? Yeah, I mean, like, I, I think so. Alrighty. We got band together and a build support to play Professor X and the Confused Claw. We got Inspired to play Reinforced Suit onto Beta Ray Bill. Uh, I did play Defender, so this is down to one. Uh, you know what? Actually, I'm going to hit this one. 
Take that down to one. Beta Ray Bill is going to take out the weapons runner and remove two threat here. Take this down to one. X will thwart here. Lady Sith, Thor, it is a treachery, Loki's staying. Dang it. I really wanted to get Loki out of there. All right, let's stand up. We got squared off. Nick Fury, love that. Energy, Defender, Inspired. Started to try and convince him to teach someone to play or get into solo at least. Oh, he's struggling with FOMO or something because he's been doing that and struggling with funds. I think if you, it, yeah, if you, yeah. Yeah. That, that's hard. I'm going to add three, take this up to four out of eight. Claw is going to attack us. We're going to block with X. It's going to be a lot. No boost effects. Loki's going to hit us for two. And Armor Guard will hit us for one. One, two, three. Encounter card is a master plan. We're going to add four here. That's totally fine. Honestly, that's what I would ch have chosen. So, <laughs> um, okay. Let's play squared off. We got Frost Giant. Comes in with toughness. I'm going to draw one, two. That is a beast. Yeah. Um, okay, so we're going to... God of Thunder to play Beast. We're going to go find Band together. We'll go God of Thunder, Band together for Nick. Draw three. One, two, three. We got Kittle Mega, which is nice. We try campaign boxes, but he only uses his cards, which limits deck building because... Pat Oh, his packs are... I was like, packs aren't rant. I see what you're saying. Gotcha. I mean, like, I, I, I totally understand the desire to have the cards, right? Like, it, they're they're fun to have. They're cool to have. Um, it does give you the option to... Uh, um, to, to, uh, to make it. Or to, to play solo, eventually. So... I, I I get I get the desire of, to want it, yeah. Okay, so we have armor guard, which is we're gonna go strength. No, uh, let's figure out what we're doing here first. Uh, Lady Sif will thwart two here. We're going to go Strength to play Kid Omega on top of Lady Sif. Clarity of Purpose will deal a damage to each enemy in play. Beta Ray Bill will attack Loki. It is not a treachery. So Loki leaves play. We'll remove two threat here. Thor will go ahead and take out the armored guard. We're at 14. Let's go energy squared off uh, to play hammer throw. We're going to hit the frost giants. We'll overkill four. One, two, three, four. Mjolnir comes back to our hand. We're going to defender... To play Mjolnir. We'll go two, four, six to claw. Oh wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. Instead of hitting the frost giant, we're just gonna hit claw, and that's that's game. That was intense. 
that was intense. Um, but I I really like the deck. I really like this deck. I love Thor. Um, but I think that this uh this works pretty well. Um, I I'm cutting build support. I think I don't think we need a build support in here. Um, but other than that, I I'm 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 a big fan of it. Nice. That's awesome. You're broke, just proxy him. That's a good point. Yeah, you can proxy him. Um, my friends started, I had the core set and we used uh, my stuff and eventually they bought their own stuff. Yeah. Not on the solo bandwagon yet. Soon. Soon. Nice. Alrighty. Okay, well, that was that was awesome. Um, I, I, I'm... A uh, big fan of this deck. I think that that was uh that was a lot of fun. I'll probably publish this one. Um, but cool. That was that. First time catching you live. Hey Zang Jabbar. I actually had a question about the stickers you use on your sleeve. I've not seen a video where you explain those. Yep, of course. So I keep one copy of every single card in this binder. And then so like if I flip here. It's just one copy of every single card. And then the other copies are stored over in a box over here alphabetically to my right. The sticker means that it needs to go back into the binder. So I, because I just sort very quickly based on alphabetical, I just flip over like this. If it has a sticker, it goes in one pile. If it has a hero, it goes in another pile. And so it's just an easy way for me to, to sort decks. And then those are alphabetical. Those are a hero and those go back in the binder. Pretty sure ethical route for magic cards is. <laughs> That's fair. I, I I really like it. I think it's a I think it's a it's a nice little system. I do have a video that goes more into depth, but that's and talks about other storage stuff. But that that's the that's the gist of it. What makes you decide to publish a deck or not? I don't know if I like it. <laughs> if I like it, I think it's good. Um, I used to think that I had to publish a deck to share a deck. That is not true. You can you can make them unlisted. Um, but I think if it's a fun, strong deck, people typically like to play those. And so if I publish it, it makes it easier for people to find. And so like with, with this, like if people see it's like, oh, that does look pretty cool. Also, it's using a, uh, some cards that you don't normally get a ton of like Beta Ray Bill, uh, Bifrost, Heimdall, those kind of cards aren't, I, I really like the Blue Thor. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I that was not saying why didn't you watch that things about. I was saying if you were curious about more, I do have a video that goes into it. But if if you don't care about other storage, there's no reason watching that video. That's what I was trying to say. Um, sweet, nice. All right, I'm gonna go to be right back. We got blue Drax next, so we're gonna be breaking out blue Drax. We have to figure out where and what we want to uh, or who we want to fight. I've been enjoying building decks. That used cards I never used. Yeah. Yeah. It's fun. Alrighty. I will see you all soon.